Hi, this is Dr. Ben Finio with Science Buddies, and this is the IoT Relay. It allows you to safely control a device like this lamp that plugs into a wall outlet using an Arduino without having to touch any of the high voltage wiring yourself. In this video, I'll show you how to set it up. Let's take a look at the device. It comes with a rather short power cord that you can plug in here, although you can use a longer one if you need more reach. Here is the off and reset switch, and it comes with four outlets, one of which is always on, one of which is normally on and will turn off when it receives a high signal from your microcontroller, and two of which are normally off and will turn on when they receive the high signal from your microcontroller. The side of the box has this removable screw connector that you can use to connect two wires to the low voltage control signal from your microcontroller. Again, all of the high voltage wiring is safely contained in this box, so you don't need to touch any of that wiring yourself. To use the screw connector, you simply insert the stripped end of a jumper wire and then use a small flathead screwdriver to tighten the screw until you can feel that the wire is held in place firmly and you cannot easily pull it out. Do that for both wires, make sure you tighten the screws before you plug it in, and then plug the unit into the side. Again, tighten the screws first because you cannot access the screws anymore once it's plugged in. I've done that for both wires here, using red for positive and black for negative or ground. I'm going to plug that in, then connect the other ends of these wires to your Arduino. Black will be ground, and red will be your signal from one of the digital I.O. pins. Here is my Arduino. I've connected the black wire to the ground pin and the red wire to digital I.O. pin 13. And I'm simply going to run the Arduino Blink example code that blinks the onboard LED, but that LED is also connected to pin 13, so that will toggle my external signal to the IoT relay and will turn my lamp on and off. Now I have plugged in my Arduino, uploaded my Blink example code, plugged in my IoT relay, and when I turn the relay on, the lamp should turn on and off. You can use the relay to make your appliance respond to sensors using your Arduino. For example, here I have it controlled by a simple switch. Here I have it controlled by a light sensor. The light turns on when I cover the sensor with my finger, so you could use this to automatically turn the light on when it gets dark. You can even use it along with a voice recognition module for voice control. On, off, for a separate video showing how to set up the voice recognition module and instructions to build your own voice controlled lamp, check out the links in the description of this video. For thousands of other fun hands-on science and engineering projects, visit us online at www.sciencebuddies.org.